Hi there, Yogi Virendra Yogi, beloved friends. One of the greatest thinker and philosopher from United Kingdom said, "I am the master of my fate, and I am the captain of my soul." Okay, and the wisest man, the enlightened man, Lord Buddha said, "We are what we think. All that we are arises with our thought, and with our thought we make the world." And one of the another wisest man from United Kingdom, James Allen said. As a man thinketh in his heart, so he is. And he wrote a book on that. And then he explained, thought in the mind has made us. Thought in the mind has made us. What we are, by thought was wrought and built. Thought in the mind has made us. What we are, by thought was wrought and built. If a man's mind has evil thought, pain comes to him as comes the wheel behind the ox. If a man dwells in the purity of thought. Joy follows him as own shadow. What I mean, if you have a definite purpose, you have made the best alliance partner who is going to support you to attain your goal, and you have developed a tremendous capacity of self-belief, self-courage, self-conviction, self-faith. You are bound to be successful if you are ready to shed blood, toil, tears, and sweat. That is, you are going extra mile, and you have said, "I want it. I must have it. No sacrifice is too great to attain the." That is purpose of your life. What we call in the success literature, we know that is victory or death, do or die. Because your mind has absolute power. Whatever the mind can conceive and believe, the mind can really achieve for you. Believe in the power of your mind. Believe in the magic of believing in yourself. Nobody can help you more than yourself. My another friend, Norman Vincent Peale said. Norman Vincent Peale said, "If a man thinks in negative terms, he gets negative results." If a man thinks in positive terms, he get positive results. So, beloved friends, you are the architect of your own fortune. A man is literally what he thinks. A man is literally what he thinks. His character being the complete sum of his own thought. So, what you are thinking? Think to be healthy. Think to be happy. Think to be loving everyone. Think to be always successful. What is? The meaning to attain the definite purpose of your life is a perfect planning, making immediate decision, backing it with perfect plan of action, persistently, continually striving and seeking different ways and means to attain it. Remembering, arise, awake, and stop not till the goal is reached. Never stop, never quit, never give up. Maybe till now you have been not very successful. Then what my another best friend William James said. This is the greatest discovery of our generation. Just by altering our attitude, we can alter our fate and destiny. True. Believe in yourself. Have a definite goal. Work very hard. And keep on keeping on till you reach your goal. There are so many people who are really getting defeated. and they give up they quit and their life is a bag of burdens sorrow suffering grief and pain adversity is misfortune is surrounding them every moment of their life it is because they have surrendered before destiny they believe in fate they believe in external forces which can really influence their life but truth is you are the architect of your own fortune you are the master of your fate and you are the captain of your soul alter your thoughts come out from fear doubt inhibition procrastination and develop that courage conviction belief and faith and the determination and the will power that you are bound to be great believe in your power of mind take full possession of your mind dream with the idea sleep with the idea awake with the idea work on the idea seek the help of the best those who knock at the door of success opens those who ask their answer the way that is truth my dear friend ask you will be answered knock the door the door will open for you and you will be answered if you are really true to yourself but nobody can help you but yourself so summary you will be what you will to be let the failure find its fault contained in the poor world called environment 
His spirit escorts it and is free. It masters times it conquers a space. It calls the boastful tricks a chance. It bids the tyrant circumstance and fill a servant place. The human will that forces and sin, the offspring of a deathless soul, can hew away to any goal. The walls of granite intervene. Beloved friends, I am as great as Winston Churchill. I am as great as Julius Caesar. I am as great as any greatest philosopher, thinkers, and politicians born on earth. Greatness is your degree of thinking how great you are. No opinion of others to define you. Who are you? Define yourself. Who are you? You are great. All mankind are great, but I am not known world over because my goals were not that great. But today I have taken the challenge to transform the mind and heart and soul of every citizen of the world. Come on. contribute yourself to making the earth a better planet with love with passion with conviction with determination with noble thoughts right thought purity of thought loving everyone caring for everyone developing yourself mentally physically spiritually emotionally becoming buddha vivekananda abraham lincoln anybody who is your idol and role model and don't be timid don't underestimate yourself you are what you have thought be contented you cannot exceed beyond your dreams beyond beyond your desires beyond aspirations that is your limiting point and there is no limit to the power of the brain what you have thought you put in your mind that is going to take its physical form my best friend napoleon hill said Truly, thoughts are things. Truly, thoughts are things, and powerful things are that. When they are mixed with definitions of purpose, persistence, and a burning desire for their translation into reaches or other material subject. Yeah, thought, thought, thought. You never can tell what thought will do in bringing hate and love. For thoughts are things. and their airing wings are faster than carry a dove they follow the law of the universe each thing must bring its kind it is spread over the track to bring you back whatever have gone out of your mind that is called law of attraction so believe in yourself alter your thought you can alter your life that is truth sowing and reaping the universal law of cause and effect is always in application there is no god There is no Allah. You are only God. You are only Allah. Align your forces with the forces of the nature. Nature is its law, cause and effect. The strength of your effort is going to be a measure of your result. Never be disappointed. Never be discouraged. Be always aggressive. Take the bull by the horn. Challenge the whole universe. Believe that you are one of the supreme power on earth. <laughs> you can do it if you believe in your power of mind. The magic of believing by my best blender, Claude Blister, and thinking go reach by Napoleon Hill, and as a man thinking is hard by James Allen. All these books can nourish you and make you great, but be ready. Be ready. Where there is will, there is a way. I am the master of the universe. I am the conqueror because I believe I am that. Thank you very much